on the hearts of so many boxing fans. Standing ovation for Evander Holyfield. Typical Mike Tyson is uncharacteristic. Questions? Touch me. The Ruelas Garcia from last year in which Garcia died. We'll see if he's overly cautious. And as soon as he hit him, he got him. He got him in right hand. A straight punch, which he normally doesn't throw a lot of. Let go. Let go. Hand up. Right by Tyson. Tyson then with a the crowl behind Holyfield. Oh, he's been able to do it. It might be something different. And he's also trying to. Tyson missing with that straight right. And he's got to settle down into regular fighting. The top of Tyson's head. Again, a good defense. When they get close, tie him up for sure and tie him up right away. But if Andrew's a warrior, he will fight. What he wants a sort of boxing match rather than just these big slugging. Holy foundation to Tyson. You know what? There you saw it in the throw a nice body shot, and it's going to be one shot, and that's it. The decibel level here is getting close a lot. We've been wondering. Oh, a straight leg. As we head for the back. Tyson, right on the butt the jab, and he slips to the side. Oh, actually, we got there. We got a little different shot. That was it. no intimidation factor here whatsoever. Well, Tyson was able to duck a number of others. Kind of smart. He's trying to smother Mike by actually getting too close. He can't fight inside with Mike. I don't think anybody can. Holyfield fighting a fight. Holyfield. That left hook missed by Holyfield. I'll tell you what, the crowd thought that Mike was hurt. This Mike might have been a good shot. A combination by Holyfield to the head. Wild miss by Tyson. Good defensive tactics here by Holyfield. Again, something unusual. Oh, a straight left hand by Holyfield. It's been Tyson holding. Not one punch, not two punches. Yeah, he'll spring there, and he'll fire a big shot. There's a big right hand over the top. Watch the time that he hits him. That's a straight shot. That's landed very well. That, that miss there. The point is, that Tyson is on the defensive against round three. Holyfield also showing more hand speed. Cuts in the process. While, while he's doing it, he's punching. Yes. I mean, he's look at look at that. Uh, it, you know, it's, it's just going to be long. Holding every time in my honeymoon in November 8th. This fight, he's made it a championship fight, and Tyson's not really attrition battle. Round number three. <laughs> As Holyfield looks to counter punch off the swinging miss by Tyson. He's coming back with a little shot of his own. I want you to do it. I'm going to sit corner, but you did hear echo outs that say Holyfield's looking to counter off your miss. We'll see what happens here, round four, in terms of time. Mike's got to find a way to rip the uppercut to the middle from on the inside. He's not getting to Evander cleanly. Hand straight right hand. Tyson taking Holyfield too lightly. Ooh. Holyfield coming on. A right uppercut. Counter punch genius. That left hook by Tyson was blocked by Holyfield's let go, let go, let go. shoulder. It, it is not letting Tyson do any of the bullying. He's doing all of it. I think it'd be a big factor with this type of fight, too. Evander can't keep wrestling with Mike all day and still be. Wild left hook by Mike. Before they get, let him have some in the round. Good four. Once you get inside, work the body. Five, five, five. Five, five. You got it where you want him now, okay? You got it where you want him. Just keep laying down. Just like Round number eight says to Tyson, work the body. Work inside by Tyson, but a glancing blow. Back comes He's disorganizing Tyson. He's keeping him out of his attack. Unleashing uppercuts to the body, digging to the chain. He has a chance right now. Vander's hurt. That right hand to the body will take his toe. Uppercut that sent Holyfield backpedaling. Only once in 46 fights. Mike Tyson with a straight right hand, but it wasn't flush if it bears true. Well, Tyson connected with the left hook. 
Good defensive move by Tyson, tucked by Holyfield. Uh, Tyson. And Evander has the reach. He should use that up that jab more. Get yourself in circle four. That's just how he hurts his opponent. Look at that right hand. And then up underneath. Look at the leverage, the bend in his legs. It's beautiful. Round number six. Round five was a good one for Tyson. The crowd. Those are smart directions. He's got to use the jab to work his way in. And then unload when Mike Weave. After four rounds, they'll go to the score cards on an accidental foul. Now, Coop wailing away. What an exchange. He came back. A cut. Not looking good. A cut. Ooh, a low blow by Holyfield. That was a low blow when he got hit. He grimaced. Holyfield. Turned. Champion. Like the overachieving warrior oh, that he is. Oh, down goes Tyson. A left cut. That was a body shot. I think he was a little more bound. Seconds left for the six. Hey, Frank, let him out. Let him out. Evander Holyfield is letting it all hang out. Take a look at the butt. Well, I didn't see much butt there. And here comes the knockdown. Now the knockdown is a surprise to I think everybody. With the shot in the chest, Ferdinand, you know, he hit him with a level in the check. It was a balance. Shot. Round seven in the sixth round, Holyfield put Tyson on the canvas. That was a well, if, if there was anybody that's energized by that, it should be Holyfield. And it's an anybody terrified by the longer this aggressive animal. He's a little sheer instinct right now. This crowd can And here is where corners save you or lose you. If Jay Bright the scorecards. In terms of an accidental foul, intelligence in this fight. Intelligence is where this is going on. Far and from it. Some. And then some. Far from it. He's fighting with the confidence of a man that knows he's got. Tyson fights at such a frantic pace, and you pointed that out. Look out now as they come together. So he's got a headbutt and hurt. Tyson, when they come together. Now, see, they both came together. Nobody. See, see look at that. Look at that. It's almost as if he got it. No, it's even worse, too, Freddie. You'll see it again. He doesn't see it. His head turned to the side, and it just. You know, again, shot to the temple, shot to the head. That can shut off your spinal cord a little bit. But, and yeah, he's bringing his head time. down, but that time it was a flash of heads. We have it scheduled for 12 for the WBA Heavyweight Championship. Surgeon, Dr. Ira Traki. He ducks his head to not catch a shot with his head up in the air, and those heads are just banging. Beautiful. One into another. Fighting. Evander has been able to do some of what I was talking about earlier, and that is sit from one at a time. Mike's got to get back into conversation, combinations. He's got to get him one, two, three at a time. He's not going to get it done. Evander's zeroing in on a big shot. Tyson is confused, frustrated. He unleashed a flurry there, but Holyfield comes right back and counters to the head. Start to wear out as he does in all fights. If that's the case, that may be the only chance. And it's tired here is Tyson. The guy that looks worn is Tyson. Not oh, nothing fights, and he is not ready to fight the 12 real hard. Did those four previous fights since prison prepare Holyfield properly? Out of here. Out of here. Uh, for getting through the def defense. He, he comes down, look at that, right through. I mean, when's the last Hughes time? He going to this fight. I think they pulled about 40 riders across the country. One good fight. And he's proving it again here. Look at this total. What have I got to do to get this guy? It's a nice right hand by Mike, but he's not falling. See Vanner stuck in, and he rolls with his right hand. There you see him again, trying to rock and roll. Mike's got it for the first time in a long time. He... Oh, yeah. What were the odds on a draw? <laughs> really handicapped. Oh, both on these. Ooh. Oh, straight right hand by Evander Holyfield. Oh. He got Mike's attention. Mike's firing back, and now the, the slugfest ensues. And a boxing and trying to land on one big shot, and that's a puncher's mistake in this game. Grab that shoulder. Okay, breathe, baby. You got three minutes. Uh, what's the combination? Okay. Focus on how you feel. And Evander Holyfield looking to dig deep, deep, deep. And I don't know how much they give a favorite uh, immortal so much that it's getting to the point where he, either he gets a knockout or he's going to win this fight. A right hook followed by a left by Holyfield. I got him ahead by three. And, uh, meaning, on every round, if you can only get a draw. That could have been dangerous. Holyfield able to recoup. Tyson missing and Holyfield countering with a right uppercut. And the punishment that Tyson has of, of cardiacs. A straight right yes. hand. Oh, a straight right combination by Holyfield. Oh, Tyson's in trouble. Tyson looking to put Tyson. 
tired he gets fired up and here comes that champion's heart and they were landing with accuracy as you can see that one at a time you can see that's the one that did it see as he can't as he came in that's what they've been saying if you ever catch him come for his previous experience came in he let the other fight go on too long and he almost stepped in the stop. round 11 and now here we Mike Tyson has fought a perfect fight. No matter what happens from here on in, we under Holyfield. Holyfield continues to dig it. A left hook to the head. He's got Tyson in trouble. Tyson's ready. A straight right hand. The Talbot stops the fight. And Holyfield has I can't see it. It's the most unbelievable thing I've ever been privileged to witness. The Vander Holyfield pulls up. And Mike Tyson on the stool. He was keeping the range in the jab. There he is. He worked it off early in the round, sticking, sticking, smart boxing, choosing his chances and his places to slug. And he just unloads, hook, right hand, uppercut, and mixes him up. Mike is in trouble here, and he's just getting teed off on. But Mike won't go down, and you'll see a good left hand and a right hand here. That started to really be the beginning of the end for Mike. The right uppercuts were landings that Tyson is famous for. He was getting hit with there. In the hook, in on the up, up on the inside. There's the uppercut. And Mike, I think not only hurt, but just too tired to continue. I don't know what he's going to say later, but champion of the world, Evander, the real deal.